While well, still on the United Nations International Day Against Drug Abuse and Illicit Trafficking, Christ Against Drug Abuse Ministry organized a walk in Lagos to sensitize people on the dangers of drug abuse. Plus, TV Africa's Destiny Momo was there. The theme for this year's International Day Against Drug Abuse and Illicit Trafficking is Sheer Facts on Drugs and Save Lives. The recent World Drug Report of the United Nations Office on Drugs and Crime states that 271 million people aged between 15 and 64 years abused drugs in 2019. That is about 5.5% of the global population. For the Christ Against Drug Abuse Ministry, it is a time to take a walk and create awareness on the negative effects of drug abuse. It's even gone higher. The country representative of UNODC said it's getting close to 20 million. So you can begin to understand the trend, the increasing trend across the world, particularly in Nigeria in age 15 to 64, of people doing drugs. And the preponderance, even in that prevalence, is between ages 25 and 39, which is the economic belt of any nation. And so we need to worry about this and we need to do something. We have found out that a lot of people actually go into drugs because they don't know the, the implication of what they are doing. They don't know the after effect. So we feel that since there are not many organizations that would treat the drug user, it's better to prevent as many people as possible from going into drugs. Yes, I've actually been down that road before, so I know what it feels like and I know how it, what it means to to have a problem and you, not, you cannot tell anybody or maybe your family, your family member doesn't know who to turn to. Main fact is drugs kill you. You know, it's something that uh, you can start it easily, but to, fit, to stop it is actually a problem. On the recent move by the Ondo state governor, Akere Dolu, to legalize cannabis for economic reasons, here are their thoughts. The fact that cannabis should not be legalized. For somebody like me that have been down that road, it started with cigarettes and cannabis, but I ended up becoming a crack cocaine and heroin addict. Cannabis is always the gateway. And um, if you go to psychiatric hospitals, 70% of the people there that have psychosis is being induced by marijuana. So we're just going to have a lot of mad people on our street. And I agree entirely with General Buba Marwa that we cannot even contemplate it. We can't control ordinary paracetamol. The use of all these basic drugs, how then do you want to control the use of marijuana? The burden of drug abuse is on the rise and becoming a public health concern in Nigeria. Studies show drug abuse fuels criminal activities like theft, burglary and shoplifting. Abuse of drugs can also lead to mental health problems and death. The United Nations say there were at least 585 such deaths in 2019. Destiny Momo for Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.